Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, welcome to my presentation. I am Irfan Apandi Batubara and I would like to share how lesson study for learning community as a window to a classroom diversity and this is my personal reflection. Here are some terms in lesson study. So lesson study for learning community is a grant from the Ministry of Education to proliferate lesson study in Indonesia. And fortunately, my campus where I teach in Medan is one of the grantee. So um, it is very interesting to get to know what actually a lesson study is. After I read and I read again, actually the lesson study for learning community, community is not only uh, learning community, but actually it is a teacher development program. So uh, in lesson study, there is open class. So open class is a class of a teacher, uh, which is open for other teachers uh, from the same discipline uh, to observe the class. And then a uh, model teacher is the teacher who teach in the open class and observers are teacher who observe the class uh, which is open and the very general uh, steps in lesson study is plan do see so the model teacher uh, will be together work together with observers in the preparation of the class and then they uh, do the class together but only the model teacher who uh, execute the teaching others observe and then uh, they see how the learning process happened how the lesson happened in the reflection after the session of the class so here it is plan do so the model teacher teach and then the observer observe in the classroom and they have re reflection after that why is lesson study different from other development program i think uh, i'm uh, i'm in the same boat with uh, bill sherbin and brian cobb so the first one is Lesson study endorses uh, collaboration among teachers. And then best practices on the show. I myself, I try to plan my class to the best that I can because the class will be open. Other teachers will observe me and I try to do my best. And then uh, actually in lesson study, it's a live observation in the open class so uh, it is not recorded but the teacher and observer teachers come together same place same time and then uh, the reflection is real time so right after the class finish there will be reflection so the observer will give feedback to the class which is very important for the model teacher for the betterment of the class um, this is how it is uh, actually you know one teacher me myself how I see my class and sometimes uh, it doesn't reflect to my next class for example at all that's why the observer teacher is very important because it will show me uh, other reflection of how I see my classroom, just like this. So uh, in an open class, at the time, uh, the topic is introduction to English debating. Uh, there were 38 students and it's approximately 90 minutes. So what I see from my class, I have made the best lesson plan and then I have tried to manage the time. I know my students well, that's what in my mind. And in fact, after the plan do and then see, after we do reflection, I got 
feedback from other teacher from the observers you know i got this very important insight that actually the students are not ready with my instruction because uh, other teacher or the, the observer see that some students want uh, further explanation so my, my instruction is not clear enough and then my students are lacking of digital literacy like the rule of using gadget in classroom when I ask them to open one website in fact they they are not only opening that website but also they open like social media or their uh, messenger okay um, and also students uh, prefer asking their friend points that they don't understand that when they think that my explanation is not clear enough they prefer to ask their friend why not ask me i think this kind of uh, reflection is very important to me so the conclusion is uh, yeah lesson study helped me see the class diversity through observer reflection and i think this is very insightful and very meaningful how i collaborate with my uh, colleagues they come to my class and uh, tell me what happened in my class that i cannot reach by myself so yeah i see that my students are different in digital literacy they not all students knows rule for example and then in fact for example i explain the subject 100% in english that not all my students understand understand english 100% at that time and they are different in their english proficiency and also uh, they are not that uh, feeling free to ask me something that they don't understand in my classroom and i have to cope with that and finally i try to get in touch with my students uh, better after the lesson study program that's it that's all my presentation thank you assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh